Okay, we're gonna do an overview on my uh, on my new headphones. They're the Razer Electrica. This is the Quick Start Guide. On how to set it up and whatnot, which cords go to which cord, and whatnot. But I'm telling you what to do. Um, that's the thing. Thanking you for buying a guide. It comes with it comes with two cords. One's a normal cord with the right or, or left angle plug, or whichever you want to call it. The other cord's the exact same one. The only difference is it has a mic. It has a mic on it, but the mic has. Um, no playback buttons like an iPod playback thing would have like you can't press anything here it's just a mic the mic works really really good I tried it out already on the headphones itself hold on yeah on the headphones itself you can take the cord right out you can take the cord right out and and as you can see the plug on the inside has like little grooves so you have to when you put it back in you put it in and then you have to turn it so it kind of locks it but it still has movement so it's a little more sturdy so this just doesn't pop right out I'll show you the sound quality in a minute He's just going to go over and do a look at it first. Razor. The cushions are leathery. I wish they were a little bit harder though, like so they don't pad down as much. But they're they're nice leather foam foams. Let's put this to the side. And they fold up, so I'll show you when they're folded up. How they look, and then they come off just as easy. Pulling these uh, tabs down feel really, really sturdy. They don't feel cheap at all, even though they're plastic. Um, up here. Up here you can see it has some cushion up here, but it's not like some other headphones where you can see another layer up here. Like if you go to uh, like if you go to my Triton AX Pros, you can see like another layer up there because the difference is the Triton's all plastic on top, where this one's all cushion on top, so they didn't need to put that extra like layer. So now we're going to go look at the the sound quality, see if it leaks, like, let me just plug this in. Lock it. So here's the, here's let's say your mp3 player or your iPod. This is a Samsung Galaxy S2 and the sound the sound on this is amazing. It has a custom ROM right now which I'll show you the what it has for the sound effects. I only put it on moderate so it doesn't like muffle anything. I have bass boost on but I have it really really slight on. I have it on flat. Strong, not the strongest. It widens the range of sound. And I have the virtual sound on. So we're gonna go back. I'm gonna show you. 
media volume is on the loudest. Let's undo that. And I'm going to put you right beside the headphone, in between. You can see both ear cups. And then we're going to press play. Size word a bit. Hold on. I'm going to find a more bass heavier song. Okay. And when they're, well, you can't put them close together, so. But when they're on your head, let's say, this is how they sound. Because let's say my, my hands or my ears covering the headset. I got it pretty close to the cam. I found the bass to be really good. They're not overwhelming. Like, there is bass, but it doesn't crackle or muffle. It's more of a rumble bass when it happens, when you do get bass on it. Uh, the bass was really good. The sound quality is really good. They were loud enough. Only problem I had was like these cushions are too cushiony. So my ear, my ear sat in the ear cup a little because this is like a little kind of like hard. Because like inside you could, the speaker indents a little bit out. So my ear sat a little bit in. But if you adjust your ear properly like inside, they won't hurt. And what else I found nice about these? Get one out. These move freely, so like if you're into sports or anything or running or whatnot. Like these move freely and they don't like hurt or break your headphones. It's like a triangle shape towards inside. And they help position your ear more better. They so got the Razer logo. It's green. You've seen it. But thanks for watching.